Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today we're going to do a cook with me. I am using a hungry girl recipe. It's called slow cooker chicken enchilada soup. So I'm using the recipe just as a base. I'm kind of going to change it up a little bit. I will actually type the recipe down below for you guys. That is the original recipe and here's what I'm using. I love super duper easy recipes. So basically everything that you see here, we're just going to dump it in the crock pot. I have some leftover chicken. The recipe calls for a pound of chicken. This is about a pound and a half. So I'm gonna shred it up and put it in the crock pot. It's already cooked, so we don't have to really cook this stew for very long. Um, I'm using one can of pumpkin. I have two cans of red enchilada sauce. Two cans, two different brands. <laughs> one can of corn that I will drain. One can of black beans that I'm gonna drain and rinse. I have two cans of chicken broth one can of small diced green chilies and we're going to use that with the juice so that's not going to be drained and then i'm going to dice this onion so everything that you see here is just going to go right in the crock pot okay so here is my shredded chicken and my diced onion so all the hard work is done and now it's time to just open up all these cans okay so here's all of the ingredients and i'm just going to stir it up it smells so good and again, because the chicken is already cooked, this doesn't really need to be in the crock pot for too long. So I'm gonna cook it on, I think I'll do high for four hours. And maybe not even that long if I get hungry before then. This looks so good. Okay, we're going on high for four hours. Okay, it's been four hours and here's what the soup looks like. It's, um, it smells so good, it's super hot. It's a little thinner than I expected, but I mean, that's a lot of chicken broth and, and enchilada sauce, but let me just dish it up and show you how I'm going to eat this stuff. So this is 10 servings, so I'm going to guess that these are 10 one cup servings, and each serving is one smart point. Okay, so here's my soup. This is chicken, slow cooker chicken enchilada soup from Hungry Girl, and I have on top I have about two cups, so I'm going to count two smart points. And on top I have a quarter cup of Kraft fat-free shredded cheddar for zero smart points and a tablespoon of Chobani non-fat Greek yogurt for zero smart points. So my soup tonight is two smart points. Yay! It's so good, you guys. So good.